Welcome to the Hour of Harvest. It is great to have you with us as we worship the Lord. Sit and back and enjoy as we share the good like news of the gospel. Body. We invite you to participate along with us as we sing songs of praise, read the Bible, and pray for those in need. The Hour of Harvest prayer team is standing by to take your prayer requests, praise reports, and lead souls to the Lord. You may call us at 606-464-4250 at any time during this program. May this program be a place where you feel accepted, loved, forgiven, and encouraged in the Lord. Hour of Harvest is touching countless souls with the unconditional love of Christ from the Appalachian Mountains to the Bluegrass region, across the nation, and around the world. From our studios in Beattyville, Kentucky, here is your special guest host, So welcome to be here tonight and we just appreciate the Lord for you just inviting us into your home tonight and we just pray that God just pours you out a blessing from this service tonight and uh, we know God can do all things tonight. We've got a great uh, line of singers up for tonight. We've got the Hall family from Berea, amen, and, and we just pray that God blesses you with their good singing tonight, amen. We've got some uh, prayer tonight. We've got the Combs family tonight, so let's remember them and Miss Margaret. We got a lady from a, a nephew and her sister tonight, and also unspoken request for her herself and her husband tonight. We got Brother Milford tonight, called in by Clifford Mullins tonight. Remember those needs, and we got a lady that named Brenda that wants to pray for herself and her family tonight. Amen. And we got a Larkin Smith, and we got a, from Inez Smith tonight. Amen. So let's be in much power for those needs. Amen. We go to the Lord in, in word tonight. See, I believe the word is very important. Amen. In this, and this is why this television program is so important tonight. Amen. And, and you know, a lot of people can't get out. This is for the shut-ins. And this is for the ones that may be in the nursing homes, the, the hospitals. And, amen. And we ask them to, to just come into your home. And just as we was praying earlier, I spoke to, to the guys and, uh, briefly, and, and I know there, there's always a blessing when I listen to them at home, but uh, we certainly know that they're able to come in and bless us in a mighty way. Amen. Let's certainly remember Miss Margaret and her family tonight. Is, uh, she's dealing with the passing of Brother Don today. I know he's certainly missed in this uh, community today. Amen. But if you got your Bibles today, and we won't keep you very long here today, Amen. We'll let their singers get right in with the word tonight. We lo we love the Lord, and Amen. We just ask Him if you want to follow along with us tonight. We're going to read a few verses of Scripture from the book of Ephesians in chapter two. Paul wrote, "And you hath he quickened, who were dead in trespasses and sins, wherein in time past you walked according to the course of this world, according to the prince of the power of the air, the spirit that now worketh in the children of disobedience." among whom also we, we all had our conversations in time past and the lust of our flesh, fulfilling the desires of the mind, and were by nature the children of wrath, even as others. But the Bible says, But God, who is rich in mercy, for his great love wherewith he loved us, even when we were dead in sins, hath he quickened us together with Christ. And the scripture says, and the reason I trope, chose these scriptures tonight. The Bible says, for by grace ye are saved tonight. And when I think of the word grace, I think of undeserving favor. And of course the Bible does say that all have sinned and come short of the glory of God today. But as we go through our lives today, and amen, and Satan has a way of coming in and making us feel like uh, we're so unworthy because maybe of our past sins today. Amen. And Certainly that may be the truth, but God's grace is a lot stronger. The Bible says where grace did abound, amen, where sin did abound, grace did much more abound today. So Jesus loves you, and if you put your faith and trust in him tonight, I know there ain't nothing, amen, that God won't bring you through. Amen. We just appreciate you tonight, and we ask for God's help, amen. And it seemed like to me the Lord, I think when the Lord put these on my spirit, someone's out there tonight that needs Jesus. And I'm a, 
and I'm a firm believer Jesus can do exceedingly abundantly above what we could ever think or what we could ever ask today. But ask you to invite him into your home, thankful for that, but also invite and ask you to not to invite him into your heart. Amen, where he'll live with you. And one day when this life is over with, that we could have an opportunity, opportunity to go home with him to be with the Lord tonight. Amen. We're honored to be here tonight and appreciate you so very much tonight. Just hang on. Good things is getting ready to come along. Amen. How about let's pray and go to the Lord in prayer for these needs and ask for his blessing upon this service. Heavenly Father, dear Lord, we come to you today, Lord, and very thankful tonight, dear Lord, just to be part of this service tonight. Lord, we ask for your blessing upon these singers, dear Lord, as they come to sing, oh, Heavenly Father, we just pray, Lord, that you just anoint their songs, Heavenly Father. Dear Lord, that your spirit go out through the airways. Dear God, that, uh, amen, that some lost soul, that, that they may see and feel your goodness and mercies of the Lord. And God, we know tonight that you're able to, to go where we can't go and do what we can't do, Heavenly Father, tonight. But we honor you and we appreciate you tonight with our Lord and our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. And we say amen tonight. Amen. Praise the Lord. God bless you all. Counts the stars one and all Knows how much sand is on the shore Sees every sparrow that falls He made the mountains and the seas He's in control of everything Of all creatures great and small He knows my name Every step that I take, every move that I make, every tear that I cry, and He knows my name when I'm overwhelmed by the pain. I can't see the light of day, I know I'll be just fine, cause He knows my name. Don't know what tomorrow will bring I can't tell you what's in store I don't know a lot of things I don't have all the answers To the questions of life But I know in whom I have believed He knows my name Every step that I take, every move that I make, every tear that I cry, and He knows my name when I'm overwhelmed by the pain. I can't see the light of day, I know I'll be just fine, cause He knows my name. Every step that I take, every move that I make, every tear that I cry, and He knows my name when I'm overwhelmed by the pain. I can't see the light of day, I know I'll be just fine, cause He knows my name. Yes, He knows. Every move that I make, every step that I take, every tear that I cry, every tear that I cry, 
He knows my name. Well, thankful to be here at WLJC tonight and thankful for, for another opportunity to lift up the name of Jesus Christ in song and hope these songs will be a blessing to you. Uh, we are the Hall family from Madison County. I live in Bria and Aaron lives in Bria and Adam lives in Richmond and we're just thankful for the opportunity to be here. And I hope, as Brother Turner said tonight, that somebody will reach out for us. And accept that grace that he's talking about to be saved for us to ever, everlasting too late. Hope these songs will touch your heart. The next song we're going to do is called I Have Been Blessed. He moves among us, all that he does, all of his mercy and all of his love. If the pen of the writer could write every day, even this world could never contain how I have been. Warmth in the winter, the flowers in spring, the laughter in summer, and the changing of leaves, the food on my table, a good place to sleep, clothes on my back, and shoes on my feet, oh, I have been. I have been blessed, God's so good to me. Precious are His thoughts of you and me. No way I could count them, there's not enough time. So I'll just thank Him for being so kind. God has been that will raise a voice that can talk hands that can touch and legs that can walk ears that can listen eyes that can see oh I've got to praise Him as long as I breathe cause I have been Father and mother, the nurtured and raised, a brother and sister, and memories made, our pastor to lead us, the altar to pray, stripes that can heal, and the blood that can save, oh, I have been. I have been blessed, God's so good to me. Precious are His thoughts of you and me. No way I could count them, there's not enough time. So I'll just thank Him for being so kind. God has been good. country, the greatest on earth, our 
flag stands for freedom and what it is worth. She stands in the harbor, Miss Liberty calls. All have gained some, but some have gained all for me to be blessed. My shoulder to me. Under his wing, he's not just a song, he's the reason I sing. Oh, I have been blessed. I have been blessed. God's so good to me. Precious are his thoughts of you. not enough time so I'll just thank him for being so kind God has been good so good I have been blessed God has been for all his blessings that he's shown upon us and for his mercy and his grace. I'd like to take a minute or two just to make a few dedications tonight to those who might be watching. Uh, we've got a good Christian lady friend that lives in Blaine, Minnesota, Donna Owada, who's watching by way of internet. And, and hope these songs will be a blessing to you and hope you're feeling better. I'd like to dedicate this to a lady that I know that works at Phillips Gas Station and Grocery in Jackson County, Nancy Chastain. I told her I'd try to dedicate her, dedicate her song today. Also to my wife, Joyce, and daughters, Monica and Christy, who are hopefully watching at home. And Kyle and Dorothy Tipton, friends of ours, and also the members and friends at uh, Galilee Baptist Church, where I go. And, just hope all these songs be a blessing to all of you. And also, uh, better not forget my sister-in-law and brother-in-law, Bob and Linda Pearson, who's watching down in Tennessee. God bless you all tonight. Hope this will be a blessing to everyone that's listening out there tonight, just not the ones I mentioned, but others too that's watching. Amen. Jesus said, let not your heart be troubled. If you believe in God, believe in me. For in my Father's house are many mansions. And I go away so you can be with me. Oh, I'm looking for a city where they'll never come a night there i'll see my blessed savior for one day i made it right they carried my lord up mount calvary they nailed his body to a tree he suffered, bled, and died for lost sinners. But on the third day, he rose up for you and me. Oh, I'm looking for a city where there'll never come a night. There I'll see my blood. 
blessed Savior. Oh, one day I made it right. Next song that we're going to do is, uh, I call it my testimony songs, One Blessed Man. And I've really been blessed way beyond what I deserve, and God's been better to me than I deserve. And I truly am one blessed man. Hope this song will be a blessing to you all, too. Truly blessed. 
And I thank God for all his blessings. Next song is called it's, It'll Be Worth It After All. After all this life is over, it will be worth it when we see Jesus face to face. I'd like to dedicate the song tonight, to especially Sister Margaret. I know she's had a lot of struggles here lately. And just pray that God will bless you and help you through all this, Margaret. And I know he's blessed you over your life with many blessings. And we thank you for your testimony. Need our spirit filled preaching. 
teach us right and wrong. We need a It'll be worth it after all, child. It'll be worth it after all. After all of these trials, we'll hear Jesus call. It'll be worth it after all, child. It'll be worth it after all After all of this climbing It'll be worth it after all And when you're down in a valley Prayer is all I do Then the Lord says to Help each other make it home. It'll be worth it after all, child. It'll be worth it after all. After all of these trials, we'll hear Jesus call. It'll be worth it after all. After all of this climbing, it'll be worth it after all. After all of this climbing, it'll be worth it after all. Next song we'll next song we'll do is the one that Aaron wrote. It's called "Here's Your Chance." And if you've never accepted Christ as your Savior, the Bible says today's the day of salvation. And if you hear His voice knocking, hard not your heart, but open it up to Him and ask Him to come in. He'll save you. So tonight, here's your chance. Are you a follower for him or 
you're just a fan of Jesus, our Savior, the Son of Man. Where do you stand? You need to know before it's time for you to go. So my friend, here's your chance to be sure about your soul. Cause there's a heaven to gain, a hell to shun, live in peace forevermore, or forever be undone. So my friend, here's your chance, through God's only Son, if there's conviction on your heart, and He's speaking to you, don't hesitate, you need to make your move. This could be his one and final call for your life once and for all. So my friend, here's your chance. On your knees you should fall. Cause there's a heaven to gain, a hell to shun. Live in peace forevermore or forever be undone. So my friend, here's your chance Through God's only Son Yes, my friend, here's your chance Through God's only Son It's been 2,000 years ago God sent His Son to die for those That would believe He died for sin And rose from the dead He came to this earth, suffered and died On the cross was crucified Oh, what love He gave all He had For the pearl of great price Oh, glory to God, I'm on my way Going to a better place We'll walk and talk with saints of old Oh, won't it be sweet We'll stand with Peter, James, and John Singing the victory is won When he purchased that day at Calvary The pearl of great pride John saw the heavens open up A man with his vesture dipped in blood That was Jesus standing there Who gave all he had The Father will say, go get your bride She's made herself ready all robed in white The church is the pearl and Jesus God's son The pearl of great pride Oh, glory to God, I'm on my way, going to a better place. We'll walk and talk with saints of old, oh, won't it be sweet? We'll stand with Peter, James, and John, singing the victory is won. What he purchased that day at Calvary, the pearl of great pride. Oh, glory to God, I'm on my way, going to a better place. We'll walk and talk with saints of old, oh, won't it be sweet? 
We'll stand with Peter, James, and John, singing the victory is won. When he purchased that day at Calvary, the pearl of great price. There's a day just out in front of us I know will surely come That eastern sky will open wide Revealing God's dear Son And I know from here to heaven Is but a twinkling of an eye in the midst of all His glory comes the sweetest cry. Welcome home. I knew you'd come. Welcome home. You're here for Look around, was it worth the wait? Welcome home, step through the gate. I believe, at least for me, I'll see my mom and dad, my brother. My sisters, everywhere you look, our friends. Oh, the greetings will be precious for those we love so dear. But no mortal man has ever heard the likes of winning years. Welcome home. Look around, was it worth the wait? Welcome home, step through the gate. I believe he's coming soon, maybe not or noon, and the twin. I knew you'd come, welcome home, you're here for good, and look around, was it worth the wait, welcome home, step through the gate.
Oh no, the old story will never grow old. How Jesus died to save my soul. Oh no, the old story will never grow old. That story will never grow old. I went to the church one lonely night. I sat way back, for my soul was not right. The preacher was preaching how Jesus died. For a sin-filled world, he gave up his life. I went to the altar and knelt down in prayer. Lord, please forgive and he pardoned me there. He lifted my burdens, brought peace to my soul. What made my life new was that story so old. Oh no, the old story will never grow old. How Jesus died to save my soul. Oh no, the old story will never grow old. That story will never grow old. Many years have passed by since I met the Lord. I remember that night when that story was told. Time has no hold on the message it brings. That story is old, but it still blesses me. Oh no, the old story will never grow old. How Jesus died to save my soul. Oh no, the old story will never grow old. That story will never grow old. That story will never grow, never grow old. That story will never grow old. Hey man, what beautiful singing tonight to... to God has supplied for us tonight. And, uh, and I just pray that it was a blessing to you. And uh, amen. And, and I know that, uh, amen, they sung from the Lord tonight. And, uh, and I just pray that uh, maybe you hear those songs. And, uh, and uh, I've got some prayer requests tonight. But uh, if you was, uh, maybe you're sitting at home and maybe you wanted to call or maybe you was maybe a little shy and uh, maybe backwards about calling tonight. But uh, I just pray that uh, God meets your need. We're going to pray for you anyway. Uh, we're going to pray for these, but uh, I'm certain that there was those at home tonight that maybe would have liked to call, but were some reason maybe hindered because of some reason or another tonight. But uh, let's remember Joyce tonight from Paintsville. She has the flu. Again, remember uh, a Joyce from Johnson County tonight with her health problems. Uh, pray for a lady named Alice from Scott County tonight and the uh, the singers are doing good tonight. Amen. Pray for, for Tony tonight from Clay City. He's sick and can't sleep tonight because of the pain that he's in. Uh, for Kerr, uh, called in from Zella tonight from Corbin. Uh, cannot hear the voices. For, uh, a lady, unspoken request, called in for mother and his brother today from Letcher County, the stress related to, with sister-in-law with cancer tonight. Pray uh, for Pauline, Aria, and Bubba tonight. There's no name from Madison County tonight. Bless those needs. Let's pray for uh, Merle Hurley, 
uh, called in by Annie Blankenship uh, from Hurley, Virginia tonight, and they're enjoying the singing. They've done a great job. Yes, they have. Uh, pray for a family tonight. Uh, a mother called this in from Lincoln County, uh, and they're enjoying the singing. Good, amen. Uh, pray for a gentleman named Jerry tonight. His wife called in from Whitley County. Let's remember that need tonight. Let's pray for uh, Linda and Jesse and Cody called in by Linda tonight from Morgan County. Let's be pray, remember those needs tonight. Uh, let's remember Thelma. She called in tonight from Madison County. Prayers for her children, her grandchildren, her great-grandchildren, her great-great-grandchildren, and her great-great-great-grandchildren. That's a lot of children. <laughs> Amen. So let's remember Miss Thelma tonight and all them kids. Amen. Let's remember Patrick tonight from Franklin County. Let's remember those needs. Let's remember Jeremy tonight from Fayette County and his friends need prayers. Her name is Linda. Remember Miss Linda tonight. Let's remember uh, a sister from a, a sister-in-law today from a, a gentleman named Terry from Montgomery County that has blood pressure issues tonight. Uh, let's pray for Wilma tonight from Lee County and pray for her stomach up and bowels. They need a touch from God and pray for her brother has cancer tonight. Let's remember that need tonight. Let's pray for a lady, a man named Marie tonight from Pike County and pray for her nephew that has cancer and her cousin needs prayer tonight. Amen. Let's remember Silas Saylor tonight from Engulfing County and pray for him and his family Amen, and the, and the people in the nursing home, and amen, and pray for him that he be able to go home. Yes, let's remember those needs tonight. And, uh, let's remember Nora tonight, amen, from Floyd County. She's having ear problems, and pray for her children, her grand, great, grandchildren and great-grandchildren. That's a little more children tonight, Brother Gary, amen. So uh, let's remember those needs tonight, amen. And you know, and certainly tonight we know that God is able to do all things tonight. And I always like to think, and, uh, and I begin to think of myself how weak, Brother Gar, that man that I am within myself tonight. Too, but, uh, and you know, to be honest, as I've read these, I can't even remember probably just a small portion of them tonight. But you know that God, the Bible said his ears are open unto our prayers yeah, tonight. Amen. amen. You know, the Bible says his hand is not shortened that he can't reach down and, and lift them up tonight. Right. Amen. But, you know, our hope is in Jesus Christ. Brother Gary, you all done some great singing tonight. We'll try our best, brother. Amen. What would you like to add to this uh, service tonight? Something you want to say? I'm just thankful we had the opportunity to be here tonight again and and just pray that all these songs we sung were a blessing. And this most of all for someone out there tonight who is watching and has never been saved, we just pray that before the night's over, that you'd ask the Lord to come into your heart and save your soul. We got some uh, more called in. Uh, people from Logan County, Ohio, they didn't leave a name, but said they was enjoying the sing yes. singing. They said they had a tornado recently, so I asked for prayer for the citizens of Logan County, Ohio. So and a person called in has a son with cancer that was called in by Patricia Hicks. Knott County and she's enjoying the singing very much and just pray for the one that's got cancer, her son. And Nora uh, Scarberry called in from Floyd County asking for prayer for her family. And Janice and husband, her husband needs prayer. He's called in and asked for prayer for them and Bowling Green. And Mary Rolls from London, she can't sleep at night. Just pray for, that God will answer her prayers and give her a good night's nice rest. And Amen. we'll just pray that God will Give her a peaceful sleep. Prayer for Phyllis Collins from Breathitt County and said to tell Brother Turner he's doing a good job and enjoying the music. Man. Might want that one, brother. And then Judy called in from Laurel County, asked to pray for prayer for Roy Lee. And then Joyce from Tasman, pray for members of her family, pray for her daughter traveling, pray her daughter had eye surgery and her eye surgery went good. And pray for her daughter's father-in-law. Let's pray that God answer all these prayer requests. Amen. Tonight. And the the Hall family, if you would like to get in touch with them, I assume that they they do a lot of traveling. Do you, Brother Gary? We do quite a bit. Uh, 
Uh, if you'd like to get in touch with us, phone number, I believe it's been on the screen, but it's area code 859, number is 893-3246. And let us know if you'd like us to come to your church for sing, singing or whatever, and we'll try our best to do that. We want to be a blessing to those who want to hear good singing, gospel singing. Amen. And they do have CDs available. So uh, if you're interested in that, we was talking about that earlier. But, uh, you know, it's so good for, for brothers and sisters to get together today and be able to see. Uh, I've never met. I, I've seen you on this program, Brother Gary, but I've never met you. Yeah, same here, brother. Hey, man, it's, it's been an honor tonight. And you and your boys, you've done, you done a great job I today. I appreciate you. did a good yeah, job, we too, appreciate for hosting, brother. <laughs> let's, uh, let's certainly, uh, again, remember Miss Margaret today and this, t this television program. And, uh, you know, uh, this, is a, this is a good work of the Lord. And, uh, Amen. And I count it as an honor and privilege to be coming and, and uh, be able to just sit instead of Miss Margaret today. I know she yeah. does a great work for the Lord. And uh, I know she's a hurting right now, but uh, amen. But you know, God is able to, to heal when no man can hinder tonight. That's right. Amen. We're going to pray for these needs tonight. We're going to go to the Lord in prayer. And I invite you to, amen, to pray right along with us tonight. And uh, amen. And, uh, and if you're standing in need of something from the Lord, I ask you to just help us today. We're going to anoint these tonight. We're going to pray and just pray with us at home. And maybe, maybe you watched this program. Maybe you, you felt the, the, the presence of God in your life tonight. Uh, man, I still believe that God is able to touch yes, you tonight. Yes. Amen. No, regardless of whatever struggles that you may have been going through in life today. Amen. If you'll seek God, amen, you can find what you're looking for. Don't let Satan knock you out of it tonight. Amen. amen. Let's do a little prayer tonight. You, you pray for your own needs tonight. God, God knows where you are. God knows exactly what you're going through tonight. Just put your faith and trust in him tonight. Amen. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, tonight, Lord, we so ask you to bless these needs, dear Lord, tonight, God. We know you know each and every one of them, dear Lord. Throughout these counties, dear Lord, uh, amen, from all of the different places, dear Lord, we just pray, Heavenly Father, that you just go in their homes and, dear Lord, see the sicknesses, dear Lord, the shut-ins, the nursing homes, yes, the hospitals tonight, Lord. We just pray, God, for your goodness, Lord. We just pray for your mercy, Heavenly Father. Lord, we pray this in the name of our Lord and our Savior, Jesus Christ. Bless these tonight and amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Brother Gary, it's been more than an honor to to be here with you guys today and a man and uh, again appreciate you for just allowing us to come into your home just for a little while spending a little time with you I urge you this week and uh, you say I, I can't go to church and that, that's that's fine amen if you can't but I urge you today keep on praying amen every uh, every day you know you, you may be in your bed of affliction but keep on praying and seeking the Lord God bless you amen Thank you for being part of the Hour of Harvest. We hope that you are truly blessed and encouraged every time you watch. This program is made possible by your contribution and support. Would you become a financial partner of the Hour of Harvest with a one-time or monthly offering? You can send your pledges of support to the Hour of Harvest, Post Office Box Y, Beattyville, Kentucky, 41311, or visit us online at www.hourofharvest.com. We also accept Venmo and PayPal. Just scan the QR codes to donate. May God bless you.